got some nice hairstyles and today we're going to style a classic neck bow. So keep watching, thanks. Start by taking a section of hair from the top of the head and we'll just brush it up. And then I'll take a little bit of hairspray, squirt it on, and I'm going to back comb it just a little bit with my rat tail comb or you can use a brush. You don't have to do this step, but I just will try to be careful with the back combing. It'll give it some more height on the top of your head. Once you have it how you like, then pull the, or just gently bring the hair down, make it into a nice little bump. Then I'm going to hold it with my fingers so I don't pull it out as I brush it, and then I will bobby pin it into place. Probably one bobby pin on either side ought to hold it. Then I will take a section from the side Brush it up nice and smooth. I'll make it a little thicker than that. And then I will bring this piece over the top of the piece we just pulled back, cover those bobby pins, and take a bobby pin and slide it in on this right side. And slip the bobby pins up through the, the top piece that's bumped up. And then do the very same thing to the other side. Pull it over, cover those bobby pins. Slip this one in and try to hide it. I have a little bit of a bump up here, so I will just take that side and tuck it under. And then for the back, I sweep it all into a ponytail, a low ponytail in the back. Brush it in nice and smoothly. Then take my elastic, and I won't tighten it all the way down. I will, on my last loop through, I will leave the hair looped over, and that will make the right side of our bow's ear. So right here, and I won't do the elastic tight. Before I can go like one more twist, this is where I stop and I make that loop to my bow's ear. And then I will hold it between my first and second finger and use my thumb to support. Then with my other hand, I will grab my elastic, loop it one more time, and reach this hair through and make a loop out of that that mimics the other side. Now it doesn't really look like a bow yet, but it will. So tighten your ponytail and then I'm going to get my brush, smooth out that tail, and then take a bobby pin and just anchor it to the head. It doesn't have to look pretty and shapely right now. We just want it out of the way while we send the tail across the front of the bow. So bobby pin up both sides, try to fan out the bow, but we will work on the exact shape of it in a minute. Then I take my tail, I'm going to send it over the front of my bow, make sure it covers my entire elastic, bring it around the back and then bobby pin it into place. See, I'm already losing my bobby pin from this right side and I'll just slip that out and then we will try to, and then we'll begin to shape the bow. So I put my fingers inside of it and I fan it out, not only on the bottom but on the top so you get that beautiful half moon shape. Anchor it down in both spots, or as many bobby pins as you need, just make sure you keep them tucked away. Fan out both sides and then get your hairspray, give it a little squirt, and I like to smooth it over so it looks nice and shiny. Then from here you just want to straighten out those bow ears so that they look symmetrical and they match each other. Smooth them out with some hairspray, tug on them, add more bobby pins as necessary, and then I have these, some cute embellishments I like to stick in. Use whatever you you have and really dress up this hairstyle. Someday when I'm awfully low when the world is cold I will feel a glow